today we will be testing soap nuts and how well they clean our laundry. Soap nuts have been used for centuries, mainly in countries like India, for not only washing clothes, but also for washing hair, body, basically anything that needs cleaning. And in contrast to other uh, eco-friendly detergents, this is a completely natural product. It is not modified by humans to make a detergent. It is literally just dried nuts from the soap industry. It's just... It's very hard. It's also... Oh, smelly. I... That's one of the downsides of soap nuts. It smells so bad. But it's just the husk. There's nothing in here. It's a bit sticky and that stickiness is the saponins that are present within the husk. Saponins are the cleaning agent within this nut. Because this is a natural product, after a couple of uses, all the saponins within this tiny nut, they're gone and you can compost this because, again, natural. It comes from a tree so it can be composted. This is a very eco-friendly way to do your laundry. It's also very cost-effective because a big box of these uh, soap nuts, they're rather affordable. They're also very gentle for the skin. It's hypoallergenic, meaning it's great for people with sensitive skins and it's very easy to use. And they say it's effective and that's what we'll be testing. I have a few reusable baby wipes that I and these I'm going to give a few stains, grass stains, wine stains and tomato stains to see how well our soap nuts clean stubborn stains. So let's test them. Let's make some of these wipes really dirty so we can see if the sheets will clean them. I'm going to test three different natural detergents. So I'm going to make three different sets of wipes dirty. The first one I will be using is laundry sheets from True Earth. I also want to test the Eco Egg and I want to see how well soap nuts clean my laundry. I didn't want to open a bottle of wine for this experiment, so I'm using Balsamico instead. You can't put soap nuts in your washing machine like this. You need to put them in a small bag. Like this. I will be putting four or five of these nuts in here. Three. Uh, this is two. Okay. Okay. After about two to three washings, you need to put in new soap nuts because the saponins are gone. I've been using soap nuts for a while, I just never have tested it on stubborn stains like we're doing today. These I've used, the smell is gone, the stickiness is gone. Stickiness is the saponin, so I know I need to replace my soap nuts. These are just the in-between jar before I put them in compost. Uh, soap nuts with the laundry. Soap nuts are known to turn your laundry a little bit grey-ish. Therefore, I put my soap nuts with laundry that I don't mind getting grey or is black like my towels. So just something I need to mention. I will be doing 40 degrees because all the other tests I've done I did in a similar way and I want to make an even comparison. So 40 degrees on the cotton cycle, 
full spinning. Uh, yeah, let's see how well it does. still smells but my laundry doesn't smell like that that's the point yeah okay tomato seeds i think this is the grass stain i should have removed the tomato seeds before Putting them in the laundry. Oh well. Grass. I think it's grass. Looks green. The grass doesn't smell like anything. This one does. But I don't know if you could call it tomato smell. Again, seeds, but the color is definitely tomato. Even the back is a bit yellow. Last one. The back of this one is also tomato, I think. But the front where I made the stain of balsamic vinegar, it's there's a faint stain, but it's not as bad as could have been. So overall, not too bad. I didn't expect uh, laundry or soap nuts to remove the stains completely, because even a decent detergent, big brand detergent, can't do that, so... But I'm surprised with how well it could remove uh, the grass stain, yeah, it's still visible. And the tomato stain is also still visible. But it could have been much worse. These I will dry before I use them next. Probably right there. These I will line dry. And thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next laundry detergent test. Bye guys.